Hey guys, welcome back to another video. We're back on the on the hardcore world. I had to adjust this entire building because I made the windows a little bit too small. So I had to adjust the entire building to make it higher. Which sucked out also Remember when we marked out the path yesterday? Well, I actually put the path in now. And it's looking nice. I decided to go with andesite, stone bricks, cobblestone, and polished andesite. To go with a nice pattern. I'm feeling like I should put like a smooth stone slabs along the side of this. To give it like a nice edge to it. But I don't know yet. But today, we're going to be working on the roof of this. And also, I had to make a new map because I lost the other one. I don't know why I lost it. And also, I filled in the roof up there. And I put bricks over top of it because mobs kept trying to kill me. So now it just looks like a wet blob. And yeah. But yeah. So yeah. That's pretty much all I did off camera. Put the load in. I fixed the building a little bit. Yeah, that's what I did. And I also put lights on the buildings. Like, I put, like, torches on that one and that one and that one. I put lanterns on this one. And yeah. That's pretty much all I did. So, yeah. But, for now, we need to put the roof on. So, let's get into it. up the building it's looking nice and yeah building's kind of looking nice but there's some few touches we need to add like lightning wards and stuff like that there's my copper do I have enough uh, if if there's nine, eighteen, I need twenty-seven. Lost a couple of wads. Don't. Well, I'll be back once I get. I have the copper to make it. Okay, guys, I got the stuff for this. Now, and it's a perfect time for it too. Somehow I lost some scaffolding. But I don't know where or when, but it's fine. Now we can go to the roof. Oh yeah, I finished the I finished building the roof while we while I waited on the car for the smelt. I finished putting the roof in, so now there's no more hole. But now we have to put the the copper in like so. Now we can put these iron bars in. And now, once a thunderstorm hits, it's more likely to hit those than hitting wood and setting 
Why well, those two things on fire? There's still a chance of it also hitting this place setting at fire. This is very flammable. Not on the outside, but on the inside, it's very flammable. Really never know, but it's very unlikely. But if anything, I want this building hit by lightning more than any of the other houses. And yeah. So, one, two. Lightning rod. Oh yeah, I got a skeleton horse while building this building. I forgot to say that. I may show it in the Wii Play. I don't the time lapse. I don't. I don't know if I did it yet. I haven't edit, made it yet. You can see it's on those orangey dots are appearing on the house now. I, I'm also adding these iron bars so it doesn't look as weird looks a little bit more natural with these iron bars. Yeah. Come on, mine them. Come on. I hate uh, having to place iron bars. It's one of the hardest things to do in this game. Place iron bars or glass panes. Pretty much the same thing. Both awful to do. You have to get the both a pain. Okay. I'm surprised how how most of the time I did pretty much about every single time I did this. I was able to stop one way away. I think I made way too many iron bars. Yeah, definitely. Eh, it's fine. Oh wait, I need to wax this. So I'll, I'll come back and wax it later on. Wait, doesn't lightning unwax things? Doesn't cop lightning unwax it? It's fine. I don't really care about that. It's not about looks, it's about how it works. You can oxidize all at once. But for now, now I want to make some smooth stone for the path. But I also need to add some one thing that's bugging me ever since I saw it. And this one thing is this one block missing because I, I moved it so I could get up there easier, but I never used it. Alright, so I'm planning on putting like smooth stone here. Problem with smooth stone is you have to smelt it twice. So, yeah, I need to find all my cobblestone. Stairs, stairs, stairs. I could just do it polished and the site. How does that look? You know what? Let's just do polish and the site. It's a lot more easy to get than the other one. That one's a whole lot harder to get. A whole lot simpler to get and a whole lot easier. Gonna have to mine this though. This this place is really going to evolve a lot. I'm just wait, can't wait till the end of the series and see how far I came in this. 
to go, so I just place these down. I would have done smooth stone, but I don't feel like sitting here for an hour waiting for it to snow. Let's do this like that. Any more? No. no some of that. I can buy some more. I might finish this off camera, but maybe because it's a long boring task with me that is very repetitive. Let's just buy some real quick. Might as well while we're here. One stack. I'm going to place in a couple of us, get them central idea of this. That's buggy. I'm going to connect to something when I figure out what I want to do with this nether portal. I don't know how I want it decorated yet, so yeah. My skeletons. Just so north. Now I can't ignore it when I'm about to die. Funniest thing, I haven't even got diamond armor yet, even though I could just buy it right now. I had the stuff to buy diamond armor. I just gotta go right here and buy it. But I don't feel like buying diamond armor yet. I, j I feel like I'm just going to use it up before I even get any good enchantments on it. And yeah. So let's get the basic idea of this thing down. And let's see. Actually, I can get rid of these torches now. But the building actually lights it up. I'm going to add light pools in here that light this place up. I'm trying to get as little of these lights on the ground as possible. They were just here as a placeholder for, for until I could figure out a different way of lighting this up. Oh yeah, I also plan on building a wall around this place. So then I don't have to deal with the outside mobs or skeletons shooting me from the outside. And yeah. But it's still a work in progress. A wall is going to take about a, a long time. And also, phantoms suck. Okay. Basic ID. We're gonna have to add this later. We're gonna have to add this later for when I add more loads. So this is the load right now. So we're gonna have to go with it for now. And yeah, I think that's a good basic idea of how it looks. And yeah. How about this? I'm just gonna use these up real quick. And then I'll be done placing it. And I'll buy some more and do the left off camera. There we go. Problem is, this is a little weird because it's in the path a little bit, but it's not in the path a lot, so it should be fine. I'm probably gonna have to light this up a little bit better. If I was smart, I would have put torches or glowstone underneath this path. But a little late now. I should probably eat before I die. 
Let's point these guys on the head. I missed. How did I miss that? Ah, messing up the world now. What? Got. He got phantom head. Got phantom head. Okay. Yeah, it looks good. It looks good on the map too. So yeah, I think I'm gonna have to end the video here, even though it's a very short one. I know it's short because the time lapse was I did a start, then a time lapse, and then now this. So I know it's very short, but I think I want to end it now because. Actually, to be honest, it's probably like a, like a three minute intro, and this probably took like six minutes. Then that was probably a minute, minute or a minute and thirty seconds about. Yeah, we got a little bit of time. We might let's check. You know what? Nah, let's not do it. Okay. Let's just end the video. So if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications, get notified when I post the next video. And bye guys.